to. And that's all the downtime we're giving you before we start the next match. Here we go. We are in losers semifinals. We have one dead eye artist. We have one a sticky Round fingers. One. Let's get started. Right. All right, we are back on the jury here, taking this one seriously. Yo, big ups to whoever just came in and claimed that code. But yes, yeah, Sticky Fingers back on the Luke, looking like a Street Fighter Six matchup already. Dead Eye Artist on the jury, one of the best juries in the business. I think certainly top three, uh, at least in NA. Mm -hmm. Ooh, looking smooth with combos like that. Gets the back throw off of that Oki. And now Sticky Fingers in a sticky situation. Uses the plus frames into the sweep activation. But Deadeye keeping calm with the blocking. He's always pretty good at just sneaking in a hit when he can best afford it. And there it is. Uh, sneaky, sneaky. Yeah. What a pick up there. Just uh, that even caught as a counter hit. So I imagine that Sticky Fingers maybe tried to catch uh -oh. it. Oh, we got the anchor arms on lock. So we get that immediate oh. flash level pick up. That is definitely the reason that Sticky Fingers is using V skill one rather than the V skill two. I know we've seen a lot of Luke's transition over to using suppressor, um, but mm -hmm. the Luke's that still choose to use V skill one, it's because they really like having flash knuckle as their go-to tool. Yeah. Oh, it's, it's great in a lot of scenarios. Nice whip punish again, Dead Eye Artist. Not able to take last round, Sticky was really able to eke it out with a big damaging hit, but Dead Eye, Dead Eye is giving him a run for his money. Yeah, well, Sticky Fingers is doing a great spot, uh, a, uh, a great show of using those ad forward advancing limbs that make Luke such a problem. Cashing out that V skill there is Callisto to Dead. ensure that they get out of the corner, but it's not going to matter with that it's early C activation. It's, I think you're just barely alive. No, you're not. God damn. It's Luke dead. borrowed some of his damage from Street Fighter <laughs> 6. That's why he's so strong in 5. You know how everyone's like, oh, Luke oh might God. not be good in, in 6 in the betas. They're like, oh, Luke isn't as oh good in, in 6 as he was in 5. It's because he stole damage I from himself. I still love everybody, everybody, including some folks that may have gotten second with him in an invitational going, yeah, Luke's low tier in six and then making him anyway. <laughs> oh my God. Nice, Deadeye taking a bit more of an aggressive approach from round start. Probably gonna get the stun here, but nope, that mm. famous three frame, that famous ass three frame. Yeah, Callisto uh, uh, definitely uh, thought that uh, they had earned more respect out of Sticky Fingers than they did. But you will never get respect out of Callisto, one of the most disrespectful players still doing work in these East Coast brackets. That's going to be the V-Trigger activation. Definitely has the damage to be able to close that one out, disrespecting their way to the first round here in Game 2. Okay, I like this aggression from Deadeye, because you got to get the damage in while you can against Luke. It, it, Sticky Fingers almost made the comeback in that round, despite how aggressive Dead Eye Artist was. And it, he might just clear this one. Oh. Tries to delay, though, does Sticky Fingers, has to eat that. And Dead Eye is going to activate with this corner pressure. Yeah, it was always going to be standing medium kick because Callisto's already recognized, like, yeah, you're hitting buttons. So look to see as this set goes on. Oh, actually, still not really comfortable with dealing with the He's ranges. Dead. We get a little bit more Why damage. No, oh, oh. no, the cross cut doesn't come out because Callisto didn't hit a button. Because it was an empty jump, the cross cut didn't connect. So this can still be Callisto's round. One more touch would do it. All we need is the right hit confirm into CA. But Sticky Fingers can kill like off CA. of one fireball and still has VT here. Yeah, he's afraid to throw that because was a of the flippy game. Look... Sorry, go ahead. Is he looking for Ross CA? I think he's looking either for EX Rio or EX or Ross CA. Yeah. And he's got 37 seconds to burn. The the frustrating burn thing is 30, that... Burn Luke... 35 of them. Ooh, yeah, but the, the You frustrating... can see I love that from Sticky Fingers, because what kept happening is they would walk into medium kick range and do it like immediately, and Kalissa was blocking every time. So they gave that extra little bit of like, I want them to walk out of range, recognizing how patient Kalissa was being, mm. ready to cash out that one bar to go over the fireball. Yeah, and that's that's what Deadeye was looking for that entire last round end. Unfortunately, Sticky didn't give it to them, but Deadeye is gonna take it now. Thank you so much, Jared, for following. It can only be Jared! <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, uh, Kill a Cleave, are, uh, they, shorts do seem to say CPS. That definitely means Capcom Protective Services uh, because they're protecting Capcom's identity moving forward into Street Fighter VI. <laughs> okay, stretching. Also going oh. for these fireball stores here and really fishing behind that standing medium kick. You can see that they want this V trigger activation. Going to have to do it on block. What's the mix going to be? Keeping it a little bit more loose because they've already recognized that Sticky Fingers wants to hit buttons in some of these spots. I love that. Going to be able to cash out the CA and it's going to be one game apiece. Really, really good situation there for Dead Eye Artist because, man, you have the life lead, so Luke has to approach you. And Luke is not bad on the approach. Don't get it twisted. But it's not a strongest suit. If he's able to wait, if he's able to wait out the opponent, he's in a much better position. And so the fact that you have to approach Jury, approach her stand medium kick, and then not get hit by it once because then you die is a really oh, yeah. terrifying situation. Um, right. So, yeah, Callisto was just in a, such a good position, able to get that second round and second game. Just the posturing around those medium kicks a real big problem here, but I think part of the difficulty that Callisto's gonna have to navigate past is like, when they're at standing medium kick, you still need to be super respectful of like, towards strong, because of all those forward advancing limbs out of Luke, exactly like that, managing to find that jab with punish on the, uh, the overhead flip kicks there out of Dead Eye Artist, who is now firmly on the back foot, stuck in the corner against a very nearly full health Luke. We do find the cross cut once again, and you cannot continue to test this man. He's got the answer key. The teacher accidentally gave him the teacher's copy. They got the answers in the back. Mm. Houseman, you went no, to college. Answer. You know what that was like. I do. I Wait, am I admitting to cheating with that response? I don't know anymore. Callista <laughs> right now on the back end still having to fight their way out of the corner again against Sticky Fingers, who is just throwing a monster bevy of normals. Good punish with the EX Fuha. Blah, blah, you're looking for positive punishment. <laughs> because I also went to college, I know this, but so what's happening is there's no negative reinforcement. What needs to happen is Callisto's jumping uh, and we are adding a stimulus that punishes them, which is that they get punched in the goddamn mouth because Sticky Fingers has had the cross cut hey. DP ready every single time. I, I, I honestly, if, if I was close to, I'd keep going for that stand heavy kick cancel because so many people fall for it. But right now, Sticky going on the offense, burning all that V trigger immediately. Tries to bait him out. Sticky not biting. Hey, gets the yeah. hit. Now easily killed with this enhanced critical art. Bam. Thank you, man. Detonate. Final round. Mm -mm. Fight. All right, one round apiece once again. Damn, that's the second or third time now that we've seen Sticky Oof. Fingers accidentally get overhead when we're pretty sure they wanted um, uh, strong strength sandblaster. So I don't know what's going on. Maybe they need to win this tournament so they can get one of those snacks box mm -hmm. micros from Junk Food Arcade who were kind enough to provide them as one of the rewards for this year tournament. But Dead Eye Artist wants to make sure that doesn't happen. But Sticky Fingers keeps getting these wake up jabs. Big punish now. You are. Fingers. No! You say no, I say yes! Not another critical art finisher for Luke today. But Sticky Fingers still has a lot of ammo stock, and that should easily do it. Silencing me ha! and Calypso. <laughs> you decided to watch it. One. No, I didn't. It cut out before the cinematic. <laughs> <laughs> well, two games to one here for Sticky Fingers. Yo, are, are we gonna uh, are we gonna have to watch? Luke versus Metro. So hold on, I'm double checking. Metro was the one who sent Sticky mm -hmm. Fingers down. Metro actually sent both of these players down. So no matter what happens, yeah. Losers Finals oh, is a double jeopardy with someone trying to get the run back on uh, Metro M. That's, that's kind of interesting to say the least. Metro right now sitting pretty in those Losers Finals, but we still have matches going on right now. Sticky trying to get the back heavy punch or heavy kick counter. And Dead Eye not giving it to him gets the reversal. Oh man! And unfortunately, the Tari combo gets Sticky Fingers out of the corner. 
and it's the same problem, right? What's happening is Callisto's going for these, you know, spacing traps that don't work because if Sticky Fingers waits, they get the whiff punish because the standing jab and the standing strong press them forward. Activation comes out of Deadeye Artist, who uh, just ends up on the back foot now. There's nothing you can really do about it. Deal with it. Stop How did that reach? Oh, because he My pressed man, the button. <laughs> that DP came from the future. He compressed space and time. Oh man, stick you know, Sticky is mad aggressive. He sometimes drops combos, but the man always has his anti-air. You knew a DP was coming. I knew a DP was that. coming. How did you not know Sticky Fingers? Callisto has never I once in his it. life not reversaled when the next hit was gonna stun. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's safe. Of course there's gonna be another uppercut! Please please play some neutral. Good, they're not checking your dashes. Here we go. This is how you start. Two bars and a little bit of V-Trigger left here for Deadeye Artist, but the activation oh, now comes dead. up and fingers, and that's a big problem. Oh, wow. So much respect for the minus two situation. Listo may be able to close this one out. Is a reversal mm. going to come out? Uh. Oh, it's not going to need to happen as Sticky Fingers is able to close it out with a jab target combo and is going to earn the chance for the run back against Metro M. That was one of the matches that started off the evening. A winner's quarters match between Metro M and Sticky Fingers went 3-1 Metro M's favor. Going to have to see how it's going to go when they now get this run back here in the loser's finals.